Hello children, today's our lesson is a great leader. So, a great leader was Mahatma Gandhi. Mahatma Gandhi was one of the greatest leaders of the world. Other leaders were involved by hurting others and killing them. Mahatma Gandhi did not use any arms and weapons like guns, rifles or bombs. And yet, he won the war of India's independence. People lovingly call him Bapu or Bapuji. Here Bapuji means father of the nation. Gandhiji was a man of iron will. Now here iron will means strong determination. If he decided to do something, he did it no matter how difficult it was. One day he decided that he would have an early morning prayer every day. From that day onwards, he never missed the prayer. Gandhiji gave a lot of importance to truth, simplicity and non-violence. Now here non-violence means not hurting others. That is not hurting others. Gandhiji's dress was very simple, just a loincloth. Here loincloth means dhoti. A dhoti worn about the knees and sometimes a shawl. Could he not afford fancy, fashionable clothes? Of course he could. But this simple loincloth was a deliberate choice. How did he come to make this choice? Here deliberate means done consciously and intentionally. Once Gandhiji was on a lecture tour in Odisha. Usually, men and women gathered in large numbers to listen to him. In Odisha, however, women were not seen at this public meeting or lectures. On making inquiries, Gandhiji found that the people in that part of the country were so poor that their women folk had not a decent thing to wear. Therefore, they kept away from public functions. Gandhiji was deeply pained to hear this. From that day, he decided to wear the bare minimum of clothes, be it cold or hot. He never changed his simple dress. Here, women folk means the women of a particular family or community considered collectively. Once, he had gone to England to attend a very important conference. King George of England gave a reception to the participants of the conference at his palace. Now here, conference means a large formal meeting where people discuss important matters. People received by the king have to dress up in a certain way. At that time, England ruled over India. So, India's people had to follow the rules. People in England wanted to know if Gandhiji would change the style of his dress to see the king. Gandhiji made it very clear that he would be dressed in his usual way. Even when visiting the king of England, he would wear the dress of the people whom he represented. Gandhiji was not bothered by what style of dress the British approved of. So long as the poor people in his country did not have enough clothes to wear. Here, represented means be appointed or entitled to speak or act for someone. And bothered means worried. Finally, the king had to welcome at his reception. This great man dressed in a simple loincloth and a shawl. The king himself was dressed quite extravagantly. Gandhiji was asked whether he had enough clothes on for meeting with the king. He replied that the king had enough clothes on for both of them. Here, extravagantly means in a way that costs a lot of money. Millions of poor people in India felt happy that Mahatma Gandhi dressed like them. Although, Mahatma Gandhi did not use any destructive weapons, 
he had millions of staunch followers gandhi ji showed all the suppressed people in the world the new path of satyagraha he is remembered for his greatness not only in india but in all parts of the world here destructive means capable of causing great damage here staunch followers means people who were firm and loyal in following him suppress means prevent to development action or expression satyagraha means truth force or holding firmly to truth so children thus gandhi ji employed non violent resistance to lead the successful campaign for india's independence from british rule and in turn inspired movements for civil rights and freedom across the world so children i hope you understood this lesson very well you also try to find out about some great leaders who gave their great contribution for the independence of india and yes in future you should work for the glory of our nation so nation will be proud of you